So next up is a Grade 1 Mersey Novices Hurdle event over two and a half miles. So Al Kudia for David Hu, Leon van Rensburg's Bomb Theory, Emotional for Joshua Sutherland, Huntsville Picnic for Vinnie Gerard, Darren Thompson's Punto Sound, Southern Optis Optimist for Greg Beckwith, David Robertson's Substitute, Joshua Sutherland's Theoretically Speaking, Mini Fortune Th Time, Leon van Rensburg, David Huey's Movie Lights and Petra Glyph. Raven for Patrick Hogan makes up 11 of these novices to go over two and a half miles here. The rain stopped, the clouds are drifting away and the blue sky is showing. As these 11 reluctantly get down to the first of the 12 flights they have to take. They all cleared it quite well. Bomb Theory made a little bit of a mistake and just shuffles back. And sort of centre course. Middle of the course, but we'll go over towards the railing shortly, I'm sure, as they all skip over the second. A better jump there by Bomb theory. So it's substitute that leads them. But David Robertson's got a three length advantage into the third. They will skip over that well. From theoretically speaking and Huntsville picnic and emotional up on the inside is movie lights. They're followed through by Southern Optimist, Petroglyph Raven, Mini Fortune Time of Bomb Theory. Now Kudia is just our back marker at the moment. to emotional theoretically speaking Huntsville picnic on the outside just followed through by Southern Optimist movie lights up against the row wider still is Punto Sound and Bomb Theory and uh, Mini Fortune Time I've, I've got Petroglyph Raven between them and then just at the back is still this Alcudia the sixth leader was slow over that this time one of the best jump was probably southern optimist sort of mid pack alongside huntsville picnic but it's still this substitute that leads taking a hold now they go past the winning post a full circuit to go we've got substitute is first and the motion is in second theatrical speaking third huntsville picnic's fourth Southern it, Optimist 5th, Bomb Theory's moved up into 6th, Punto Sound the widest of all is 7th, and we've got Mini Fortune Time, now Kudi has made a little bit of improvement up on the inside, and then Petroglyph Raven's our back marker at the moment as they go off and out to the back straight. Substitute Jockey looks around, so check how close they are, they're so through about a mile and a half now with a mile left to run. Still this substitute taking another breather now and allowed theoretically speaking. Let's get within two lengths. Moving well up on the inside is Al Kudi up. He's got the row to help. As they get to the seventh, they all clear that good jump by our leader substitute. So we've got a couple of lengths advantage on theoretically speaking. Movie lights moving still well up on the inside. Huntsville picnic. Widest of all still is this Punto sound. As they go to the eighth, that's five from home. Substitute, theoretically speaking, trying to get closer order all the time as you go over the ninth. And we'll clear that as well. The one that's dropped out towards the back now is Southern Optimist as they start the turn towards home with five furlongs left to run. Substitute. With a couple of lengths advantage from theoretically speaking. Al Kudia trying to pick up here in this soft conditions, but it's Substitute that still leads out of the pack. Here comes Movie Lights and Bomb Theory as they go over the tenth with two to take and it's substitute still Lee's been there since the beginning but here they come Alcudia movie lights bomb theory theoretically speaking is not picking up between horses is Huntsville picnic and it's substitute and bomb theory as they come round this final turn with just two to take and it's substitute and bomb theory Huntsville picnic on the wide outside is Punto Sound movie lights and emotional got a bit to do but it's bomb theory that now takes it up approaching the penultimate bomb theory from substitute Huntsville picnic Punto Sound they're over it well together great jump there by Substitute comes to join the leader again, but it's Bomb Theory still with half a length from Substitute's not picking up Huntsville Picnic. Mini Fortune Time as they go over the last, and it's Bomb Theory, but Substitute up on the inside on the wide outside is Mini Fortune Time, and it's Substitute and Mini Fortune Time are inside the final half. Substitute Mini Fortune Time, Huntsville Picnic, 
Mini Fortune Time in between horses, Alcudia, but it's Mini Fortune Time that's going to take this. Takes the Mersey Novices Hurdle. Great one event for Leon Van Rensburg. Well done. A winner on the board for Leon on day two as we approach the Grand National. Oh, the Stewards' Inquiry. They were quite. Let's wait to see. And he hasn't lost it, but Leon van Rensburg takes it with Mini Fortune Time. Alcudia for David Hooley just nosed up for second. Our long-time leader, substitute for David Robson, was third. Huntsville Picnic for Vinnie Gerard was fourth. And Emotional for Joshua Sutherland was fifth. <laughs>